Well, when Chris Paul was there, it was the Hornets. Yeah, but I was they yeah. fans too. I remember they changed to the Pelicans. Mm-hmm. I had I was like, man, they should have left it at the Hornets. Like the Hornets were fire. The Hornets was fire. Why we changed that, bro? Well, y'all got Pelicans out there though. The Pelicans swag. Though. We don't got Pelicans, bro. I saw one Pelican. Wait, bro. there's no Pelicans in fucking I New saw, Orleans. I saw one Pelican, bro. This is this is an atrocity. And that was this year, bro. This is an that atrocity. was last year, bro. What a terrible name for a franchise. If there's no fucking Pelicans, they don't even have Hornets out there. I, I mean, we knew that. They should have named it Voodoo or something. The Voodoo. Is the Voodoo shit real in New Orleans? Yeah, that shit definitely real. Because... You can feel it in the air. When you go out there, you can smell it. Like, it's just it's just a feel in the air out there. Like, do you know motherfuckers out there be putting the Voodoo hexes on motherfuckers? Or? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't think so. Yeah. Not that I know of. If there is, I would want to know. Yeah. Because I won't, I won't do Voodoo on no people. You would do some Voodoo on somebody? Yeah, for sure. You cast a spell? Yeah, a good spell then. Like what kind? I never see the bad spell. Would you ever make a like maybe make a chick fall in love with you? Cast that spell? Nah, not that spell. But just make everything go how I want it to go. I think it's it's safe to say it's going pretty well for you. If a girl fall in love with you, bro, like if you make a girl fall, bro, you asking you asking for something that you really don't want, bro. Girl's crazy, bro. But if you cast a spell, it could be any girl. It could be Nikki. Still, Nikki-Bro. bro, it you be, don't want. It could be J Lo. You don't want Nikki in love with you neither. Like, bro, if a girl in love with you, bro, she, she, brother, she crazy, bro. Mm. I don't want no girl that crazy over me. So you are trying to prevent women from falling in love with you actively? Nah. I just not. Right now, it's a cool in love. Okay. Not no voodoo in love. Voodoo in love is like, boy, I'll do anything. Right. That's like Krishan Rock crazy. Yeah, I don't yeah. like that. Yeah. That's crazy to me. Yeah, you don't want a girl with your face tatted on there. Yeah, that, I wouldn't respect that. She tagged at my table right there. Krishan Rock with a fucking knife. That's her, that's her fucking artwork. Damn. <laughs> what is it? C plus J forever. J is Jonathan Blueface. Oh, she's crazy. Damn. She, she, like she, she started a heart. She started a heart. Blueface didn't finish it. Bro, it was it was a fu- I don't have a knife. Let me see. I'll finish it. Don't do it with your nail, bro. Uh, I can't even do it. <laughs> I tried, Kishan. Is this a, a this is a great chain you have here? Uh, how how new is this chain? I'm not gonna just be in like December. That shit is serious. Yeah. Do you feel like? Because I do feel like when we see a lot of young artists, we always hear kind of financially. They make decisions when they first get a lot of money that they regret. Are you being pretty smart with your money? I'm being pretty smart with my money. What are you doing with it? You investing? Like, I did not want to buy this chain. Okay. For starters, like just because I know, like, man, this shit costs a lot for nothing. Like, right, bro. I, Tax write off. Yeah, exactly. A prop. A prop. Right. I remember like being in a project, like, man, boy, two hundred thousand, boy, I would have. Died to have that money, like mm-hmm. I just spent that shit on the chain, bro. You tripping, bro? You spent two hundred thousand dollars on that? Like, like close to two hundred. Wow. I know. That's a lot. That's a lot, huh? So, what are you doing with the rest of your money? Investing it. Buying real estate. Yeah, real estate properties. At home. Yeah. Is the I can imagine the is, is the property value pretty pretty low? You can get in pretty low right now. Um, pro- like they got fixer uppers. They got a lot of fixer uppers. Right. That's that's like. New Orleans getting gentrified quick. Like, well, I know Brad Pitt and Brad Angelina Pitt. Jolie had a house yeah. at the French Quarter, right? Well, I ain't gonna lie, bro. They got they got Brad Pitt and Angel- Jolie houses in New Orleans. Like, you drive past that, but you gonna know, like, oh, that's one of their houses. Like, they mm. crazy. Like, they thought process on they on their cribs crazy. They got shit like you can rent out. Like, oh, you can like rent like, out. Like they house? they like I'm saying like you okay. get properties. They, yeah, they getting properties out there. I think they got divorced though. For real? So somebody, one of them two owns the house now. I don't think both of them do anymore. Usually Damn, that's, bro. Yeah. See, that's what happens. You fall in love, you get married, and then you break up, and you have to give, you have to split everything in half. That's my. That's I'm not getting married. Don't get married because then you get divorced, and the girl gets half that chain. You have to cut that fucking thing in half. I'm not getting married. Bro. Yeah. I'm not trying to get married. 